In Asia Pacific region, actually, the, the biggest uh, environmental issues that we are facing at the moment is uh, deforestation. So this is huge issues being faced by the regions. In, in other part also, you have a, less, a lot of, of, of plastics uh, pollution, for example. But when we talk about deforestation, it's, it's, it's main, it's the central issues that are being faced by the, by the regions. It's not just about forestry, eh? but also the, the mangrove forests are also gone for almost, let's say, like 40% within the last 30 years. This is very critical issues need to be addressed in the, in the regions. The, the summit event like the APRS uh, are very important for the regions. It's not just about doing the, what you call networking, but also to demonstrating the leaderships and as a commitment and maintain those kind of partnerships among a number of players like governments, like a private sector and also civil society in conserving the, the, the forest, uh, the, the, forest the, the conservation of the forest. And also, meanwhile, to really how this kind of a partnership can be really developed further to support a kind of sustainable development. Mangrove ecosystem uh, has been a very, very uh, critical uh, ecosystem for the, uh, the Asia Pacific regions. Mainly, it's because of the the function of the mangroves is not just because of the natural barrier for the small island that we have in the regions, but also the mangroves are a critical a kitchen for the fish because they're producing this kind of, uh, a lot of this kind of uh, you know, fisheries and also uh, crabs and everything. It's a kind of a protein source actually that's supporting the, the, the communities who live, depend on this mangrove system. It's not just about fisheries. Mangroves also a kind of, a, from my perspective, is it's a, it's a kind of a capital that producing uh, an ability to store carbon that, for example, has a potential to if really manage well and reduce those climate impact. I like the dam of protecting people and supporting the economic growth, actually. This is a kind of a, a, a central dam when we do a conservation, which is sustainable development. It's not just about protecting, but also create a kind of a, the economic that really help people to be uh, adapting or adopting this conservation measure to gain a kind of conservation uh, and also development growth like this. So this is a, a very must align with the CI principle actually uh, because we are uh, doing this kind of program on the ground by right? protecting conser uh, and conserving this kind of uh, natural habitats but also generating the economy.